I am not a morning person. It's 10 to 6. Yep. And we are... Oh, you don't have to answer, Dad. I'm vlogging. <laughs> I'm so tired. I don't know why I'm vlogging. It's just going to be me standing and going, Ugh. but Kiara and I, uh, she's just not impressed either. <laughs> um, we've got a, a flight at nine o'clock. We've got all these lemons, by the way, and dishes, but lemons, well, lemon tree you, can't, you can't see the lemons. You could before. Oh, you, you could before. Don't tell me how to vlog. Uh, yeah, our flight's at nine o'clock, so we've got to move so I can get some cups for coffee. Get moving, and Kiara's making the coffee. My dad, Paul, hey. Hey, dad. dad is driving us to the airport. Good man, good man. Um, my voice sounds like this because not last night, but the night before, we went out for my birthday, and I had way too much fun. And I sing way too loudly when I go out dancing. And um, yeah, so this is my voice. I don't think I'll be able to say anything interesting at all at the moment, but you know, this is the life of an adjudicator. We get up early to travel places. Uh. All right, so I'm feeling a little more. That's not even. What are you doing? Oh. <laughs> you can just add oh. it here. <laughs> okay, so I did say I was doing better, and then Kiara happened. <laughs> yeah, so I've had my coffee. I have mascara on, starting to feel more human. Um, Mark's got work today, so he wasn't able to drive us to the um, to the airport. airport. Thank you, Dad. <laughs> <laughs> Paulie H coming in with the save. So it's Queen's birthday, public holiday, so the boys need someone to look after them, but both their parents are off working. Oh. So, yeah, they'll spend the day with Pa. Kiara and I have a fair bit of work to do on the plane mm -hmm. um, and once we get up there we don't have to start until it's tomorrow we start isn't it Tuesday yep. um, I was at COFS last year um, and this year I'm doing I'm there for solos week I did groups weekend which is just finished up there I did groups weekend last year can you tell you had that one um, yeah so doing their solo stuff um, it's quite a big comp like it's you know a whole week of just solos what's going on um they have lots of improv sections they have demi character improv at this one which i am super excited about it's nearly 6 30. yeah i know kara's just difficult <laughs> oh, no. so first full start i left my phone how am I supposed to Yay! function without my phone? Yay! And by function, I mean, how am I supposed to call my boys when I'm away? Say hi, boys. Hi. It's too bright for Indian. It's too early. Okay. Charlie, stop eating Optimus Prime's head. <laughs> oh, seriously. You're not getting out. Can I have a kiss to Indy? I'll see you in a week, okay? I'll give you lots of phone calls. You're not getting out, you're staying with Pa. Mm. You stay with Optimus. Can I take Optimus? No. No. That's mine. <laughs> Charlie kisses. Bye-bye. <laughs> no. no, you're gonna stay. You stay here. Mm. Thanks, Dad. Bye. Bye. So Just said goodbye to the boys, just gotten here. Terminal 4, gonna check in, get our bag tags. Um, definitely the hardest part about traveling. I love traveling for work, but the hardest part is saying goodbye to my boys. Um, but I like them to know that they have a mum that does things and works and yeah, they don't get too attached. <laughs> Yeah, love them. 
Ah, I want strong, independent boys. Who are sensitive. I want everything. I want co I want coffee. That's what I want. I want coffee. And my jaffle. And coffee. Essentials of travel. Food and coffee. <laughs> it's Brunetti's. Don't judge me. It's Brunetti's. That's why I'm vlogging because I'm sitting at the airport having cannoli. That's fancy. Oh! Vanilla cannoli? Nutella cannoli. And that's your gluten free flowers thing. It looks nice actually. It does. Accommodation. We have an apartment. It's fabulous. It's really lovely. This is my room, my bed. It's, you know, pretty standard hotel apartment typey situation, except because it's an apartment, um, the size of it, like that's the mirror. Huh, that's my cupboard. I've got my own ensuite. Ooh. My ensuite has a bath. Yay! Um, this is Kiara's room. Here, Ooh. yeah. So the size of it is like the that room that I'm in is about the, the size of what I'd normally get as in a hotel. So yeah, it's really cool. There's a second bathroom there, and now we're going upstairs, 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 upstairs. We have the kitchen. There's Kiara eating a twiggy stick. <laughs> The good twiggy sticks. The good twiggy sticks, yeah. We've got kitchen tips, kitchen table. Look at this bat massive TV. Go this way. Dining area. Little city sitting area. Wooden floors that we're gonna dance on because we need to do some lesson planning for the master class. And We've got a view of the, um, well, essentially we've got a view of the station. I think it's a train station or a bus depot. Yeah, train station. Charlie would love it. Trains. Choo choo! Look at the palm trees. You can kind of see the marina or the beach or something in the background. I don't know. But it's lovely. We like it. We're happy gonna go and make some lunch we're having greens so we're having like um, asparagus and broccolini and beans and spinach dip and some twiggy sticks we're gonna eat that out here on the deck because we can we're fancy like that uh, now this is just to Selena this is not the standard life of an adjudicator accommodation setup but when you're lucky and you live in Australia you get to go occasionally get to go to places like Coffs Harbour. Coffs Harbour is the type of place where it kind of doesn't matter where you're staying. It, the whole town is like this, so it's pretty beautiful. Yeah. Um, but I'm going to eat. So if you're a caffeine junkie like me, there's a common problem in hotel accommodations. Um, and I've talked about it in my other adjudicating vlogs, and that's the coffee cups in the rooms. They're always like those little, like, 
about that big, sort of. This place. It's got mugs. Like actual mugs. <sighs> it is such a beautiful day here. It's not too hot. I can still wear my new fur. Um, we are walking up to the theatre because it's like 200 metres away from our hotel. So we're like... Let's, let's walk rather than just ignore Kiara. She'll say random things that aren't pertinent to my vlogging. Oh, but yeah, she's sure. allowed to have a life whilst I vlog. <laughs> I'm not happy about it. but <laughs> um, Yeah, so we're just walking up to the theatre for day one of the Coffs Harbour. The Stedford. Slept really well last night. It was a very comfy bed. I would have, would have preferred a little bit more time to sleep. But that's just life isn't it then wouldn't we all like more time we've got about I think we've got seven improvs today don't we Kiara about seven um, so I was just getting all the music ready for that and I'm really picky with my improv music so I just wanted to make sure that um, a it was music that I don't mind listening to 17 times because they all dance to the same piece over and over again. Um, it's not like the American style in an improv comp, they all, they're all they all on stage at once. This one is they hear the music once, then they come on and dance. And while one person's dancing, the next person's in the wings listening to the music, and then they come on and dance. So they're all dancing solo to the same piece of music. So myself and the audience get to hear it a lot. Um, so, I'm not sure which way we're going. Um, there's every chance we're going the wrong way, so I'm gonna stop vlogging and actually pay attention on where we're going so that I can actually get to work. Okay, we're on break for day one in between the morning and afternoon session. Um, we are eating incredible Thai beef salads for lunch. They're so good, aren't they? Yes. Where is it? Urban Espresso Lounge. I would like an espresso as well, but mm, yeah. Um, so what's happening at the moment? We're just going to have a quick gander. There's been an issue with the tarquette that's been laid on this stage and the committee have very, very smartly decided to delay starting the afternoon session until it has started. Um, now, this is something that they absolutely have to do, but it will cause problems as far as... Um, excuse me. As far as running smoothly in the comp, things will be delayed. Yes, people might be a bit, oh, we're finishing late, blah, 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 but... The floor you dance on must be safe. And I have been at comps where I know they wouldn't have done this. They would have just shut up and kept going. But they're actually putting the safety of these dancers first, and that is super important. Um, so if you're ever at a comp and a safety issue happens and it delays you getting home, deal with it. Or don't do comps. We're on break. We're gonna stretch. So I've gone, Kira, let's go get some air. Let's go outside and get some air. And what does she do? Sees a handrail, turns it into a bar, and stretches. We stretch like this. We, don't say we. I'm we. not putting my leg up there, girl. Oh, no. I stretch. I'm wearing she jeans. Blogs. I'm wearing jeans. I'm wearing jeans. They'll do split. Smash you, smash you yeah. Get your foot out of my face. They're pretty, baby. <laughs> <laughs> so, so, so. Apparently, I inspired her to do some Did stretching out of the way. I'm I didn't awful inspire you. Vlog vlogger. Oh, no, I can't. Beautiful, I can't. lovely, controlling developé. <laughs> Work to keep your sternum lifted. Oh. Blur this bit out. Lovely hip alignment. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> this is what not to do. I do need to stretch my back out. Though. Yeah, you do. <laughs> Here's the desk after a morning and an afternoon session and after dinner. Dinner. And that's a Kiara. You're going to get so sick of her face in this vlog. 
but no more sick of hers than mine. Oh, no. Coffee cup, coffee cup, you. drinking chocolate, water. I'm getting into trouble because Kiara's <laughs> working and I'm in her way, well, which is right. fair enough. I don't know what Kiara's talking about, but she was just telling me about a mistake she made. Naughty girl. Theatre's filling up very slowly. People out there. Is David the videographer? Just before we start our evening session, uh, if you have uh, dance today and you've chosen. Okay, end of day one. We're back at the apartment, about to have a glass of sangria. Um, it's really hard to come down, I suppose, <laughs> after a full day. Um, but super exciting, like I never knew my life was leading up to this moment. But today I saw a Demi character for Indiana Jones. It was awesome. It was so good. Um, he's a very talented little dancer, the guy that did it. Um, yeah, he was great. Wasn't he funny? Yeah. He was so cute. And then dinner break, you rang your boys and told Indy yeah. all about it. Spoke to my own Indiana. <laughs> Aww. It made me really miss him. I think he thought it was pretty cool. Yeah. Yeah. And yet I still have Wallaby of Broadway in my head. That was the last dance of the night. Mm. And I'll probably have that song in my head for quite some time. I've got lavender blue in my head. Aw. Mm. Come on along and listen to Lullaby of Broadway. Lavender's blue, dilly dilly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're a bit tired. Just a bit tired. Sangria time. Ole! Uh, it's day two. Um, clearly it's the morning. Because... This is, oh my god. I am so tired. I slept really badly last night. Um, I kept having bad dreams. Um, and I woke up at, I woke up at like 3.30, which is probably because Charlie tends to wake up then, so my body just goes, oh, wake up and feed your baby, but my baby's not here. Hopefully someone fed him. <laughs> Um, and then I woke up again at like, uh, I woke up at about, about 6.07 the clock said. And I woke up very, you know, like, oh, I've got to get up, I've got to get up. And then I was so irritated because I set my alarm for 6.30. Don't you hate waking up before your alarm? <sighs> so here's today's outfit. This is my version of 80s corporate power suit. Mmm. He man. And the masters of the universe. Kiara's, Kiara's still trying to figure out her fringe. It's, it's a thing, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Mm. Get um, it's really hot in this bathroom. Ah, look at this. I have a curl. You're alfalfa. Alfalfa. I like that. Oh, no. Hello. No way am I sitting next to you all day with that. Harsh. Harsh. So I was um, going to go for full faux hawk, mm. but I um, gave up halfway through. And I also thought maybe it was be a little bit intimidating because at this comp I'm sitting fairly far down the front and uh, there's lots of audience behind me. Crazy green-haired lady people sitting be like, in front of exactly. you. Exactly. People will be sitting there going, a classical solo with a take off ball. your hand. <sighs> End of day two. We're back at our apartment. The lashes are off, which is why my eyes look a little bit weird. We're, break, we're being naughty. Shh. We're ba breaking the low-carb diet and we're having nachos. And as you can see, Kiara's very excited by it. I went down. I put the nachos in. I went downstairs to go to the bathroom, come back up, and she's just sitting there watching the oven like this. Oh, my goodness. I'm very excited. I love nachos. What are you watching? Dream Dance Company. Oh, uh, Michael, De De Michael, Michael, what's his name? Demeski. De Michael Demeski. Mm. Yeah, he is very lovely. Yeah. Very lovely. Uh, um, it was a really good day. It was a really good. Oh. Shush, I'm talking. She's fabulous. Okay. <laughs> so 
sorry. <laughs> um, yeah, it was a really good day. It was just a tough one. We were quite tired, um, and that's one of the that's that's one of the hard things about adjudicating. If you get tired mentally, you just well, you just got to keep on keeping on, um, and it's hard to do that when you're sitting still. Really, really hard because when you're sitting, your body just goes, huh, we're allowed to be tired. We cannot have a sleep. Go and nine you, nine you go no, no, you can't go no nice. You gotta what? Well, you gotta pay attention to the dancers, and it's it's um yeah. I swear I'm not drunk right now. <laughs> I'm just deliriously tired. Um, however, I am going to have a glass of wine because I need to calm down. So we're going to be naughty and have a glass of wine and some nachos, and then go to bed. Go to bed. Yeah, she's killing me. She's taking forever. She's just, we just spent five minutes inside with me going, okay, come on, let's go. And Kiara's sitting there going, yeah, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. So I'm going to point a camera at her and make her feel uncomfortable. This is what you get, this is what you get for not moving faster in the morning. So how are you doing, Kiara? I'm pretty knackered. I'm pretty sure no one heard that. I'm pretty knackered, <laughs> to be quite honest with you. It's day three, we're about to start the evening session, and I'm pretty sure this is the first time I've vlogged for today. It is? Yeah. Camera happy Claire has not vlogged yet. I'm not camera happy. I'm a very lazy vlogger. Very lazy. Um, it's been a great day. Yes. Really good, very intense, lots of, lots of improv. Yeah. Lots of improv, which still terrifies me, because um, I, I enjoy improv doing it, but it, it, I always was too critical of myself. But um, why don't you tell us about improv, Kiara? How much do you love improv? <laughs> I hate you. <laughs> when Kiara was one of my contemporary students, we'd do improv, and she'd stand there oh. with her petulant teenager face on, refusing to move. She was just so crippled by anxiety, and um, weren't you? I still am. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing's changed. It's amazing to see all these kids just with so much confidence just oh. getting out there. Yeah. 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 And they, we did a demi-character improv and I got to give them a, it was the so music good. and a theme and a prop. So I gave them a jacket and there were 16 in it and 16 people danced with Kiara's jacket. Yeah, my denim jacket. It was lovely. And, it's a pretty good jacket. Now, it is. It's a good jacket. It's a good jacket. Um, it got its wear. I haven't worn it enough. You ha no, they you did. haven't. Yeah, they wore it. Well, there you go. 16 dancers wore it, which means 16 sweaty kids. Yeah. I'm going to pay for dry cleaning. So we're going to, it's the end of day three, and we're going to go and annoy Kiara. Why are you that? You literally just told me to go have a hot shower and go to bed. We are delirious. Oh. Last night was delirious in a no sleep sillies kind of way. And tonight is delirious in a I can't function kind of way. I'm actually doing not too I'm badly. I'm so tired. Kiara? <laughs> Kiara's kind of dying. Tell them what you, what you were just saying about your hand. Because Kiara's been writing all day. Like so much writing. Tell them what you were saying. But it feels like I'm still writing. Yeah, and I just had this, I, she said that while I was in the other room, and I just had this picture of her laying in bed, trying to sleep, <laughs> going, do it, do it, do it, make the content oh. better, and, like, actually writing, like, her hand, just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but, no, it must, it must be like that, and we both keep doing, like, talking in adjudicator speak. Like, I'm just wanting to work for more consistency and authenticity and uh, blah, blah, blah. I was literally just saying that. I was like, oh, it's like I've got restless leg syndrome in my arm. Like, it's just consistently moving with this sense of, like, shake. And I was like, oh, uh, my God. <laughs> poor Rara. You're lucky I'm not a gremlin. Oh, no, it's not 12 a.m. yet. No, it's really not. Good night. Good night. we got master classes in the morning. Yay! We actually get to get up. I am excited about the master classes. Are you? Yeah, Kiara's going to demonstrate. Oh. Not right now. In the <laughs> Kiara's like, get the selfie light out of my face! <laughs> I am so horrible. <laughs> you really are.